for both heroes. Uh, but we're not in Fraldon. Right? We're in... Um, oh, I don't even know where we are. Uh, are we... I, I don't know if we're in Orle. I guess we'll learn that eventually. So we just started yesterday. Just, 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 just started. And uh, we'll see. The the game... My, my reception to this game so far is that the combat seems a lot more fast action-paced. Uh, the game is a lot smoother. It runs a ton smoother. And graphics are more enhanced, so I do like that. Um, talents seem a bit more condensed in some ways. Condensed and more enhanced. I don't know how, how to... Um, I say more condensed because I feel like if I go into character um, abilities, I feel like there's somewhat less choices in this talent tree. Because you can like have specialization. Oh, we have specialization points. No, maybe maybe it is expanded. Because I was like, maybe there's less choices. But maybe it's just the way that the talent trees are arranged. Um, I'm thinking of going for my rogue here. I'm thinking of going um speed, speed oriented for a, spe a specialist. Go a specialist, and then maybe like um. Hmm. I don't know if I'll go duelist. Specialist assassin. Sabotage would be cool too. Um, I'm not quite sure, but I know we're going specialist. Dual weapon, not sure. I don't know how many what how many levels we can get. By the way. Uh, and so far with my playthrough here, I know I'm keeping the dwarf. Or rather, like I'm, I'm gonna have him on my meet team. The rent, the other two, I'm not sure. Aveline and our, our, our sister, uh, Bethany. <laughs> and maybe, maybe we'll keep our sister, you know? Um, maybe we'll just switch our main tank here. And uh, I think we'll, we'll do that. Okay, so we had a few quests to do, eh? Long Deliver Flemus Emil to keep Marenthi in the Danish camp of Sundermount. Alright. Okay, so we need to deliver Flemeth Samuel Levy. I don't trust Flemeth. I feel like she has an ulterior motive, right? Uh, Morgan's mom. But I don't think we have a choice. Bethany seems unsettled. Talk to her. Oh. I talk to her now. I can't wait to see what our ancestral estate. I think I need to be in my my uh, my room, my uh, house. So let's go to the, our house. And let's talk to Bethany. Bethany seems unsettled. We'll start off with that. And then go from there. But so far, I'm, I'm quite liking the Dragon Age uh, playthrough. The, the Dragon Age series. Um, it's uh, it's kind of cool. <laughs> to explore that series. Uh, the Hanged Man. A business discussion. So I do want to do that. Let's go to Lower Town. And then we'll go to the hangman. I think the hangman is um for um what's his name? Varric's uh uh proposition. How come you and Wesley never had children? We said I could gain I'm untold sorry, riches from uh, right. that quest. I was a soldier and he was a Templar. We knew that our personal lives would have to wait. Distance never mattered. Okay, hangman, that that's where I gotta go. Barracksley, uh, Gamblin's we house. That's time. our, our, uh, it is what it is. our very, very shoddy house. Well, actually, it's not even our house. It's our uncle's house. Because apparently he lost the estate, which, um, he lost our estate. Well, not, not our estate, but I'm thinking it is our estate. Because he also says that he can't find the will or he, uh, he left the will at the estate, which that we don't own anymore. So I'm willing to bet that the, the estate was actually bequeathed to, to us, but uh, he doesn't want to say. <laughs> That's what I'm assuming. And uh, let's talk to our sister here. So, I hate thinking badly of family, but did Uncle Gamlin seem a little slippery when he talked about Grandfather's mm -hmm. will? He did. If he, say, invested money that was meant to be mother's, do you think he would tell us? He would not. Uh, I'm close to born liar. Gamlin can't say good morning without lying twice. Mother's been in such a fit of melancholy since mm. Gamlin told her how angry her parents were about father. She told me 
She wishes she'd died with Carver. No. It's like coming here ruined every good memory of her childhood. I wish we could get some of it back. Well, we can't change it now. Unless we somehow turn Gamlin into an upstanding citizen. What's done is done. Gamlin told me he gave the estate as payment to some slaver who beat him at dice. Apparently, our ancestral home is now a base for slavers from all over Thedas. Hmm. You gave our home to slavers? Gamlin couldn't have just sold himself and saved us all the trouble. <laughs> Can you just imagine him sweeping and scrubbing for some Tevinter matriarch? Seriously, though. Hmm. Those scum have no right to our family's things. We should break in there. Get the will for Mother. Oh. We could. I already talked to both of them about this. Gamlin said they guard the front entrance well. But Mother gave me her old key. She said it should unlock the cellar. Apparently the sewers run right beneath the house. Interesting. Interesting birthright. Maybe, maybe we do that, chat. I mean, that's where we go. Uh, <laughs> uh, what's over here? Oh yeah, we we had a, we have all the DLC, right? The Mental of Legacy. I don't know what those are. Uh, we're not going to do those right now because I have a bunch of DLC, and um, I don't know what the best thing is. Uh, oh, I can order ruins and potions from our house. Okay, that's kind of nice. Yeah, so I have a bunch of DLC, right? And um, I'm trying to keep the experience as... Well, I don't want to say as vanilla as possible, but like all the extra gear that we got, I'm not taking. Because I don't want to be completely OP and uh, ruin my item progression. Hmm. So let's, let's just that. Yeah, let's go Birthright. Let's do that. Dark Town. It seems like I can switch between daytime and nighttime. Like when I access these areas, that's kind of cool. Uh, we'll see. We'll see how that goes. Oh, so so we're just uh, we're just doing this, eh? We're just going in from the back. Uh oh. I'll go. Wait, I have a uh, speed activate. Okay, that's perfect. Wait, let's take care of these archers. Nice. The idea sounds that wait, OP and ruin the game unless you want to bet and kick everything on Nightmare. Yeah, we're playing on hard right now. Um, but I, I stashed all my items, all my DLC items in my stash. But also, what up, Hester? How's it going? Uh, that's what, what my inkling was when I saw some of the DLC items. Like, someone had like 500 fire resist or whatever. I was like, this doesn't seem right. Um, I stashed them and maybe, uh, maybe like, um, halfway through the game or, or, um, or something, I'll just sell all the items and I'll have gold to spend on, on other regular stuff. <laughs> right, that's my idea. So I'm using it as a future cash. I think that's the best compromise. Huh? Oh, Hawk. Haven't seen you since we did that job together for Athenra. Been a while. Mm. Heard you're going on some expedition into the deep roads. And right into Darkspawn territory. Sure that's wise? Eh, uh, it's a living. You know? We can't <laughs> make a living in the Undercity. Just watch your back. That's all I'm saying. Say, you still in the market for some poisons? Athenra's scarce mm. these days. Poison. And the Coterie have their own mixers. You find any rare reagents and want me to whip you up something? Just let me know. Okay. In fact, since you're an old friend, here's a recipe. My speciality. Everyone needs an edge sometimes, right? True, true. Uh, debilitating poison. And uh, by the way, if I, I did do uh, Dragon Age one like not long ago, we just finished yesterday. So we're doing all the Dragon Ages, uh, Hester. That's that's what I'm doing right now. And if you're like, damn, I miss I miss Dragon Strength playthrough of Dragon Age One. Uh, it is mostly all on my YouTube right now. Uh, I think I'm missing two streams to upload, and I will be uploading this uh, on YouTube as well. <laughs> so, what do you do, Adelie? You know I'm a god. Why are you asking? 
Do we go in? Oh no, this is just potions. Hours for... Debilitating poison. Uh, I need a deep mushroom. Oh, you what about Mustier? How's it going? These are my off-duty hours. And the trend of you scaring the piss. I I saw I saw the uh the images, the Discord images. <laughs> hmm. I swear it wasn't me. It was an imposter. It wasn't me. Okay. So, oh, they're all going for the tank. That's good. Okay, there, there we go. Just have to my two YouTube wall. Thank you, sir. That helps me a lot. I'm just kind of like starting out on YouTube, but uh. I'll try to upload some interesting things, or at least try to. <laughs> or the things that I stream. Rule of thumb: if the criminal runs to the sewer, ooh, death route. He's gone. Yeah, this game plays. Uh, I don't want to say that completely differently, but it it is kind of different. <laughs> It did take some, some getting used to, um, compared to Dragon Age 1. Slaver, they're all slavers. Mind your manners, this is my territory. This is his territory? Well, not for long. Yeah, this is like the slums, eh? Which, uh, apparently, uh, I did hear that they're planning a Dragon Age 4. They're indeed planning a Dragon Age 4. So, um... I'm... I'm hopeful that it's good. Right? Uh, they're, they're planning a Dragon Age 4, and I think they're planning a Mass Effect 4. Or, or what have you. So that's very interesting. Uh, oh, I see. That's where we came from. You know, this game, particularly the ambience and the writing, uh, so far it's really good. Freedom. What a crock. Yeah, so far I'm liking it a lot. I didn't expect I would like a, because I I played Dragon Age One back in the day, but it was so long ago, right? It was like when I was like, People I don't remember when. Here? It amazes me. And um. I remember nothing of it, <laughs> and so it's cool to, to see uh, the rest of the series here. Oh, confirm. Yeah, skill and party combos are super cool. I think this is the cellar door. Uh, I'm liking Rogue so far. We played the mage before, and now we're doing Rogue. I think this is the plan: Mage in Dragon Age One, uh, Rogue in Dragon Age Two, and I think we're gonna play Tank in Dragon Age Inquisition. Um. And I'm going to make myself as a character in Dragon Age uh, 3. Mm. So I'll get to try all, all classes. But I do like having the element of choice. Right? I think Dragon Age does this well. Where you're giving like lots of choices. And so far, I guess I'm going through the, um... I can't remember what the, the town route it is. Oh, we can level up. Uh, I'm going through... The Specialist route. Instead of selling like dual weapon, we're gonna go max out Specialist. And then we'll see. There's so many things I could pick. We're not going to take archery. We have Varric as an archer. I think either sabotage. Hmm. We'll see. Let's level Varric up. I I'm liking Varric so far. <laughs> uh, cunning. Hmm. There you go. 
Oh, uh, oh wait. Yeah, Archer. Bianca. <laughs> uh, level 7. Oh, I see. Oh, there you go. Hail of Arrows. The Archer unleashes an entire quiver into the air for a short time after the missiles rain down on enemy ranks. Oh. And we attack. Yeah, uh, Bioware, at least back in the day, right, um, from what I remember, the writing was top-notch, like, I played, a uh, the first Bioware game that I played was Neverwinter Nights 1, and I was absolutely hooked on that game. I had all the expansions, uh, uh, Tides of the Underdark, uh, sh the base game, and, uh, and the other one. <laughs> Can't remember what it's called. It was really cool. But unfortunately the graphics are very very dated. But like I mentioned a bit earlier, uh, I guess uh, in the week, uh, I am interested at some point, don't know when, because our game list is very very big. Um, I would love to try out Jade Empire. That's another Bioware game that uh, came out, but I never really got the chance to uh, to check out. So if I can get my hands on it, and if it has the same level of writing and storytelling, it could be interesting to check out. Check out and showcase. Uh oh, we're stuck. Wait, if there's spider webs, that means spiders. Why? Why are we spiders? Okay, we can do a uh, stun. Every game chat. Every game. Oh, that guy just used a potion. Beam Dog remastered never much nice than some of the titles, former Bioware and Devs. Really? As in remastered as in like actually remastered or is it just still looking very very dated? <laughs> because not all remasters are equal. Okay. West Dragon Age 2 is very very cool. Uh it's uh wait, have you never played Dragon Age 2? Lies. <laughs> Lies. History of Kirkwall. Dragon Age 2 is 2011, it took a few updates to become sharp. Mm. Well, it, it is very, very sharp seeming right now. It is smooth chat. Like, the movements? Is it different than Inquisition? Yes. It's uh, the game before Inquisition. Watch your step. Oh, trap. Oh, I want to attack him. Okay. <laughs> I want to talk to him, but I guess uh, I can. Nice. Let's take care of the mages. May not have played this. Hmm. If you like Dragon Age titles, uh, Arbors, maybe could be on your watch list or, or playlist. But so far, I'm very impressed. Ooh. Oh yeah, the music doesn't stop when uh, I pause. <laughs> that is true. Dragon Age 2 has the fastest combat mechanics, Dragon Age Origins has the slowest. Okay. And Inquisition is like middle, middle groundy.
Yeah, so we're gonna get our estate. Our, our uncle's Kamastas, maybe. That should do it. Everything we want to know about our family is inside. Everything? I guess our, our will's in here. Orange silver invoice. Protect the sigils. Grandfather Armelius' will and testament. This is it! Grandfather's will! Mother needs to see this as soon as possible. Uh, not yet. I still want to look around. All right, but hurry. Hmm. I still want to look around. Oh, I can't. Oh, can I? Hmm. I don't know if uh, quick save works. I press F5. Hmm. <laughs> We're going in. With this dragon age servers? Just a very interesting. Yeah, I tried to access my old Bioware account and I couldn't. <laughs> I don't remember what uh, 14 year old's Drex uh, password was. And no, it was not password. <laughs> Do you ever think about that, chat? What young you had as like passwords and stuff? When I was young, young and naive, player, player customizes Hawk. The game also alters the family models to resemble the changes. Oh, so Bethany, my sister, would uh, have like let's say if I had blonde hair, right? <clears throat> Bethany, my sister, would have like blonde hair as well, and stuff. That's cool. That's really cool. Did you like that? I was kind of scared when I played the uh, intro of this game. Hopefully, it's not not, not bugged or it's loading. Um, yeah, I was kind of scared when uh, you started the game, like not having customized your character. I'm like, am I stuck with this model? <laughs> oh, so just end up at uh, high town. Oh, see. Maybe here, I, should here I thought I would be. Um, Have you penned some warnings for the lawless? Who's that for? Yeah, here Most I thought I would be uh, going readers. inside my state. Seems like pacifying the nobles. Pictures then. It was just a suggestion. Well, how about a giant sign that you? Wait, let's see if I what I can equip here. Okay, we can't equip anything here. Mask of the Imperium. Oh, I just got that. Mask of the Imperium. Okay. Hmm. One thing that I wish though, I wish you could zoom in your character. I wish like this this whole thing would be placed like maybe on the side here, and then you have a giant model of your character so you could see like, like turn them around and stuff. I feel like this is so small, but then again, back in the day, we did not not have this resolution. Remember playing at six hundred by four hundred, <laughs> uh, back in the day. <laughs> uh, I remember, like when I played Diablo two. It's literally zoomed in. Okay, let's do it more tag. Uh, six half. Let's do that on Bethany. No, no, or tank. No, let's do that on Bethany. Because I don't know if I'm going to keep Aveline. Says don't. You could hit people with it. Or, or actually you. have Aveline in my my main uh, party here. Uh, let's go to hmm, Low Town. Because we're going to talk to our uncle, I think. Because we got our, our will. Right, I think. I look at my quest. Confront Gamlin with his father's will. <clears throat> oh, Banner Orvis, are you uh, are you doing well? I, I don't want me to like ask straight up on stream. He said you have to go on antibiotics. Hopefully, hopefully you are. If so, I'm hope there, sending all the good vibes. Sending all the good vibes. So I'm just saying, blood's blood and all, but you are taking advantage of my hospitality. Hmm. 
It's only fair if you make something of a monthly contribution. Only wants rent. You sold my children into servitude. Now you're asking me to pay rent? Uh, maybe just put something towards food. You should be paying us, Uncle. We found the will. He forgave you, Mother. Grandfather left you everything. Oh, really? Here, read Everything? It. Uh, ah. So I he's the Maz. Maybe... To my daughter, Leandra, and all children born of her, the estate in Hightown hmm. and all associated revenues. Also, you can kind of see, yeah, uh, Elden is right, like, see, we have the same eye color. So if I would have taken a different eye color, her, uh, my mom's hair color would, uh, eye color would be different, right? And stuff. That's kind of cool. So wait, <laughs> wait, hold up. What if I made like a, um, a super ugly purple, uh, um, purple monster, right? Like if I completely messed up the whole facial features, like purple, uh, uh cheeks all puffed up, like incredibly long nose. Would the same thing happen to my family as well? Hmm. It has been done. <laughs> because if it if it does, then that's uh that's very nice. I approve. Um keep reading. Check out the part where Gamlin is left only a stipend. To be controlled by you. Hmm. Gamlin, how could you? You're the one who ran away, Leandra. What happened to love is so much more important than money. It is! You didn't even come home for the funeral! The twins were a week old! We all have our burdens. Mine was looking after a life you abandoned. How long was I supposed to wait? Did you wait one minute? I doubt you let the ashes get cold. I took care of father. I stayed. And on his deathbed, all he could talk about was Leandra. Look, sister, I'm sorry. I shouldn't have done it, but I did. And there's nothing I can do to get it back. I don't expect that, Gamlin. It's enough to know mother and father didn't die angry. I'll petition the Viscount for rights to reclaim the estate. Make a willing. You'll have your house back within weeks. You don't have the coin or standing to even get an audience with the Viscount. Oh, when he gets standing. You've got to be someone in this city to live in that house again. Then I had better get started. Oh, so we need reputation. We need street cred. <laughs> That's what we need. <laughs> we need all the street cred. Come on, Bethany, let's do it. Why don't you go pick up something at the market? You could use some air. What? Hey! I can't believe Gamlin stole Mother's entire inheritance. I mean, I can believe it. That's the worst part. I could never turn mm. against my own sister like that. Uh, I don't know about that. Don't make any hasty promises. Joke all you want, but you make Gamlin look like the toad he is. You know, when we went to look for that will, I thought we were doing it for Mother, for what she lost. I didn't realize how much it would mean to me. Mm. To know I had grandparents who didn't hate me. Uh, they just didn't know you. They might have been alright with the Ferelden thing. But just imagine if they'd known you were an apostate. You're such a wretch! Oh <laughs> no. I was just hoping it would be different this time. Here in Kirkwall. We're not running away again. We're coming home. Um... It sounds sad. Are you unhappy here? I wish I could do more for Mother. Carver's death. It's killing her slowly every day. But maybe if we can reclaim some of what she lost, it will help. I'd do anything to get us back a normal life. I need a lot of gold. Hmm. Maybe we can make some gold doing some uh, dubious uh, things. Why avoid the circle? Why did Mother and Father work so hard to keep you from the circle? Would it have been so bad? Mother watched her cousin lose so many children to the circle. It was her worst fear. And then one of them became the hero of Ferelden and saved us all. The Maker works in mysterious ways, right? Uh, what would Carver have said? 
What do you think Carver would have made of all this? He would have hated this place. All the sneering nobles. He'd have gotten himself arrested the first day. And he would have wanted in on your Deep Roads expedition. Anything to make a name for himself. Sometimes I still can't believe he's gone. Niels Badman. And what would it have been like? Can you imagine if we'd grown up here? Been nobility? Had grandparents who bought us all liege and silk dresses with lace petticoats? Father was a good man. But mother gave up so much for him. Of course, mm. if she hadn't worked up the nerve to elope, she probably wouldn't have been able to resist the Templars either. If we'd been born here, you'd be nothing more to me than a name the Circle kept in my file. Um, do I get too comfortable? We're home. Do I get too comfortable? Let's see if Mother gets us that mansion. I don't want to call anywhere Uncle Gamlin is home. <laughs> Has he moved that bowl of porridge since we've been here? It's been a year. I can't even remember what it was like to have a place of our own. Mm. I might even take the circle if they'll give me a clean bed and my own sheets. We don't have a bed? <laughs> hmm. Oh, we do have a bed with spunk beds. Wait, do we even have... No. Like, like, just like, I don't know what the, the heck this is, but it looks like cardboard. I don't think that's a pillow. I don't know what that is. <laughs> hmm. I think this is a picture of Mother. She looks like you. Where did you get that? Was it at the estate? Let me see. Picture of Mom? Is it? I think this is Mother's betrothal portrait from when she was supposed to marry the Comte. Look! You can see the ring. And no wonder she left it behind? I suppose it would have been a bit awkward to take it with her. I know she loved Father. I guess I just wondered if she'd have been happier if he hadn't been a mage. If I wasn't a mage. I used to wish I had just been taken by the Circle, like our cousins. I could have been the hero of Ferelden. Maybe then Mother would have stopped second-guessing herself. It's nice to have a reminder of a time when she still knew how to smile. Hmm. You should speak to the dog occasionally. Oh yeah, we have a doggo. Hello, doggo. I didn't know you could talk to him. He wasn't like this in Lothering. I think he misses the open fields. Uh, wanna play? Come on. Let's play. Fetch the invisible ball. Poor thing. Maybe he'd be happier if we brought him with us more often. Uh, Gamblin might miss him. But if he's with us, who'd keep Gamblin's debt collectors away? True. Take it. I'm sick of what's his name staring and panting. Gamblin, honestly, a Mabari understands what you say. Try using his name. What's wrong with Doc? Real easy to remember. That's not nice. Also, oh, we can name him. Well, what do we name our dog? Um. <laughs> uh. Hmm. Listen, chat. Billy. We had Billy in the first game, but Billy the second. Billy too. Okay. It's a it's a different breed of dog. The Billy dog. <laughs> Billy the second. Billy too. And then if we get a dog in the third one, we can call him Billy 3. <laughs> oh, I, I can't take out the dog? He's not a party member? Which is... Hmm. Well, what's this? Gamma's house. Wait. Um... I have, I have a letter. You see that? What, what's up with that? Part of the Billy Club? Maybe, maybe. Looks like the dog's trying to tunnel his way out of this hovel. Can't blame him. Oh, it's a writing desk, right? Yeah. I got a lead for you. A merchant uh, at our goods floor told me that workers have gone missing from his bone pit mining operation. He mentioned that the missing miners were Ferelden, which make me think of you. Uh, if you're interested, go hit up Hubert in the high town market. Okay. 
Uh, to whoever elects to participate in the charitable deed of assisting the Vale family of Starkhaven, His Most Worthy Highness, Prince Sebastian Vale, has provided instructions for anyone brave and noble enough to attempt er eradication of the rabble who would dare attack his family. Three groups of Flint Company mercenaries have been sighted in the Kirkwall vicinity. Their own group makes camp not far from the Elves of the Sir Mount Mountain Range. The second has been seeking information on the docks after nightfall. The third is far from the main road off the wounded coast. They are believed to have a small campsite pa well past the unknown landmarks. A princely ward awaits whoever finds it to piece all these ropes. Okay. Great. Um, seeking information on the docks after nightfall. So let's actually do that right away. Just so I don't uh, forget. Let's go to the docks. And I guess I could go like night nightfall, right? I don't know what this is. Well, that's like... Oh, I see. Sunder map. So maybe we could do that real quick. Uh, nighttime docks. Oh, that's kind of cool. So switch from daytime to nighttime. I like that. Hmm. I like. The streets aren't safe at night. We should do something about that. Uh oh. I saw dudes. Okay. We'll get these archers. Because I, I can, like, my job is to target mages and archers. And, uh, you know, they can take care of the, the main masses. And maybe I can, like, distract the main masses sometimes. I think that's probably better. Uh oh. Okay. But that way, because archers seem to be uh to do a lot of damage if left alone. Same thing with mages. I think that's what happened in the first game. Be there we go. Care to help he's sent from that? the hotkeys. Oh, is he? Oh, yeah. Well, there we go. We got a, we got a doggo. Feels good, man. Well, a bit late now, but you know. That's kind of cool. Does he get stronger every time I, uh. Warehouse this trip? Every time I go around? Like, every time I level, I mean? Yeah, let's grab these crates. And there might be loot here. Oh, there's more. Okay, um, any other archer? There's one right here. Right, we don't have that much, uh, um... That many skills yet. So we're a bit lacking on that. But once we get more... I'll be even better. I, I died in. Okay. Well, that's not good. Hmm. Maybe I can use Bethany then? Hmm. I did see my health. <laughs> there's no way to. Yeah, there's no way to revive just yet. Uh. Spell magic, walking bomb. I also have a hotkey for like potions now. 
I guess we kind of had, had a hockey before, but you know. There you go. Wait, does this mean? Oh yeah, we're injured. So we still have injuries. Injury kits. Um. What about this? Oh, I see. There you go. Just use passage. I wonder if we should go down there. <laughs> I mean, that kind of goes out of the scope of our of our. Um, of our mission here, but I'm kind of curious. <laughs> I mean, there's something down there. I mean, um, let's go to the docks. Let's go to disuse passage. Meet after. Let's clear out the top first, and then we'll go down to the disuse passage. Yeah, let's do that. Oh, okay. Mahalo. There's more raiders. Don does not acknowledge the whole command, nor does he trigger traps from running over them. Um, that's, that's nice. Because uh, <laughs> if he didn't and hurt to hold, but triggered all the traps. Oh. That thing just died. Let's finish it. Yeah, these these raiders have a lot of HP. There's even more. Okay, I should help out. Where's Varric? Varric is over there. I should help out Varric. Okay, she. I can heal her. Half potion. Yeah, I gotta remember that uh, I gotta kind of control other people too. <laughs> oh, Varric's running away. Well, I can take a rescue raiders. Okay. Nice. So we're getting the hang of things. But the combat is way more fast. Characters fall in battle receive injuries that reduce maximum health. Oh, I see. Oh, it flat out reduces maximum health, thing. Eh? Hmm. Interesting. Oh, so every every character has their own uh, bar. Take back our streets, filled in refugees, canary soldiers, who next to richer slavers, snatching children out of their beds. This ends now. I'm thinking F5 saves, but I don't see any like a uh, uh, notification saying saving. <laughs> I'm thinking it does work though. That, that was a lot of loud scream. <laughs> Hang on, we got the Flint Com Company uh, mercenaries. I can't do that. Box of 
Use the rogue with sufficient skill to open locked items to disarm traps, lock traps difficulties. I don't think I can do that. Why? Uh, it's uh, based on a cunning, eh? So I can't open the standard chest for now. I am pop, trying to pop cunning on uh, on her. But I suppose uh, I'll go to chat attributes. Yeah, I probably need two more cunning or something. We're almost leveled, so um, maybe we can go into the disuse passage for now. Maybe I can level up and then come back there. Hmm. We'll see. We'll see what's down here. Trap. Or trap. There's a lot of thugs here. Uh oh. Heal. Nice. Oh, that wrecked me. That was a mage bomb. Uh oh. Okay. Hmm. That was like a wa uh, walking bomb. Damage is casting. And there's no one to revive a character yet, eh? Okay, we'll we'll heal our tank. Hope no one else needs this. Let's do this. Apparently I couldn't cast. There you go. So mage is a uh, mage is a bit different here than Dragon Age One. Only oh, like disappeared. This alchemy slack has a uh, stealth skills. There you go. So we're injured. <sighs> so I guess I gotta be a bit more careful. Wait, we should be almost leveled. All set. Oh, he's selling stuff. Uh, well, let's see if I can equip some things here. Hmm. Imperial, Imperial Hood Blood Helm. Uh, Instruction Sasha Hawk. Oh, I see. Hmm. Uh, Ipsen healing to this character, 7 health. Okay, so I can't, uh, can't equip that. Um, dagger, 12 physical damage, so this is better than Forces Blade, short bow. Uh, let me guess, I can't take away Bianca? Yeah, that makes sense. So Varric only uses Bianca. Improves with level, level up. That's fair, okay. So for him it's like... I only use Bianca, nothing else. Bianca's his baby. <laughs> uh, I guess we can keep the blood help for now. Uh, I guess I could have gotten an Imperial and Blue staff. I guess I'm not going to buy. Ooh, that's $8. I have $12. Half of the Primal Order. Fire damage or cold damage? Damn. Um. Enchanted Courtry Mage Gloves. Two mana stamina, four defense. Uh, I could buy that, those gloves. Enchanted Silverite Chain. Uh, plus one to all attributes, 11 defense, 10, 3% magic resistance. Um, that could be interesting. Um, that's $5 though. Mm. Sell all junk. Oh, there's a sell all junk button. That's kind of nice. Do they have upgrading? Rogue's Ring. Ooh. I'll take a rogue's ring. Because I am a rogue. Very nice. Yeah, there's some things that I'm like, maybe I should buy. Oh, what's this? Some stuff here. Remains of Outlaw. Yeah, some things I'm like, hmm, maybe I should buy for my party members. But, uh, <laughs> I don't know yet. Uh oh. I 
that's a trap. Okay, we're fine. So there's a trap here. Then, uh, very, very suspicious. Captain resource discovered. Ooh. Oh, this bad guy's here. Okay. Because then I'm thinking if I find a few people here, maybe I can take uh, the treasure uh, outside up there. I think I'll need like um, but too cunning in my uh, my thing though. My attributes, but I think that's fine. Oh, the mage. And guess it's uh, he's immune. Yeah. Uh oh. Heal. Uh, we have to heal. Oh, I got electrified? Potion. Okay. <laughs> oh, that's not good. It's too much. He's gonna and yeah, he's gonna cast something. Okay. And we can stun him. Oh, and he used the potion himself. There we go. That was kind of scary. Yeah, these guys can be kind of tough. Hmm. Wait, we're a uh, playable character. Oh, we're so close to leveling. Oh no, we're not. Right? Because this uh, is this the XP, gar XP bar? It is. So I have like this much left. It's kind of cool that you can see the XP progression. Got a ring. But there's so there's nothing here. So I guess I got I had a kind of like a quest thing that I could do. I could do here. Is there anything on this side? Oh, we already did this. So I'm hoping I uh, I got everything. Docks. Yeah, let's go out into the docks. Oh, my! I have an actual collision uh, against my characters. I don't think Dragon Age had what uh, Dragon Age One had that, like character collision. Never a shortage of idiots who think they can take the streets in the dark, but good reward in getting rid of them. Okay, so did we did we access this area? I think we did. I think we did. Um, so let's head back. We can hand that quest in, or, or you know, whatever. And we'll see. As you recall, the evadeability may be helpful in dodging effects and moving quickly. Evade. Hmm. I wonder what a uh, specialty that is. Yeah, I definitely have to check. And the black forum. Okay, so I was thinking maybe maybe I go to Wooden Coast. Hmm. Sunder Ambush site. The way it should be, long way home. Oh, I see. Sunder Mount. Duty. Hmm. Wait. 
deliver from Miss Samulet. Uh, find a way to become a partner to get the deep to get the Deep Rose expedition started. It is a vile quest. Bring the fifty sovereigns to Bartrand to become a partner in his expedition. So I need fifty sovereigns. Damn. Take Amulet to the ambush hiding uh, along the path of Sunder Mount. The location of the bandits will only be clear if she is present. Oh, I see. Um. As premium content, side quests. The maze of a missionary sister who fought, sought to bring the Chant of the Light to the deck place of Kirkwall, dark place of Kirkwall. The Chantry archivists are always looking to, to catalog their lost on the memorial wall. Hmm. So I, I guess I could go to uh, Sundermount. Hmm. We can see. So go to Sunder Mount and see what we uh what we have here. Cause we have to stop an ambush or something, right? Yeah, I guess I have to uh if it encounters in day and night. Oh I see. And don't get saved. Uh, I uh, I've been pressing F5, but I don't know if it actually registers as saving. So we're right after this. We're gonna heart save. Because I don't think I can save in combat. Wait. Is that good? Now it's active. Should be a visual indicator. Like I do have five. It, it kind of shows a visual indicator here, but it's and I'll save here, right? But if I look at my saves, it doesn't seem like there's a there's a thing. Um. Hmm. Yeah, it does seem like there's a quick save. Unless uh, it's this. I said Lord of the Ring. Center mount, yeah. And uh, let me just go to options. Um, key bindings. Quick heal. Mm. Quick save, F5. Um, so it is a five for quick save. Oh, I see, see right here. So, so in the save, uh, when I click hard save, I don't see my quick save, unlike a uh, Dragon Age one. Interesting. That's actually kind of cool in a way that um, makes it so that you don't overwrite your quick save um, potentially. With the heart save, Alfred. Oh, uh, Dalish here. Old Shemlin, your kind are not welcome among the Dalish. Hmm. What did you call me? What's a Shemlin? An elven slur for human. Oh. It means you're not one of the people. And you should leave now. Well, that's not very nice to say. Uh, what are the Dalish? Who are you people? We are the last of the Elven. Keep that in mind, Hawk. Elves you see elsewhere, figments of your imagination. <laughs> okay. They have given up their identity <laughs> to live among Shemlin. They're Elven no more. So they're not Elves. They're Elves, but they're not Elves, you know? So, can I go in? I'm not expecting tea and cakes. I just need to see someone. There's nothing here for any human. Wait, this is the one the Keeper spoke of. The Keeper? A Shemlin. I thought she'd be an elf. Enter the camp. Keeper Marathari has been waiting for you. Cause trouble, and you'll meet our blades, stranger. Hmm. Uh-oh. <laughs> Marathari? 
I was told to bring you this amulet. Can't be good. And Aranatishan travelers. Indeed, I am Keeper Marathari. Let me look at you. There is a light in your heart, human. Don't let it go out. You will need it. Tell mm. me how this burden fell to you, child. Um, yeah, whatever Plymouth gave us, uh, I don't trust it. Because let me tell you a tiny story, too. Well, not a tiny story, but um, ever since I played Final Fantasy IV, any, if any of you have played Final Fantasy IV, any package that I get to deliver from an unknown person is suspicious. Because like in Final Fantasy IV, um, when the king gave Cecil um, the package and gives it to, to, to that summoner village, and turns out to be a bomb and kills Brydia 